Hello folks and welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play The Witcher 3. Today's episode is brought to you by The Book Thief. Thank you very much The Book Thief for your continued support on Patreon. Very much appreciate it. So when I was running around trying to find people to sell to, I found this lady. Greetings. Greetings. Very freckly young lady here. Mind who I sells rest. I don't know why I act like I never talked to her before. But uh, it gives me Draconoid oil. Draconid oil. And enhanced draconid oil. Awesome. See ya. Fare thee well. And let's go ahead and make some of that. Nope, they did not fix that bug, which is pretty amazing, in a way. Depending on how you define amazing, amazing. Uh, I, she also sells bear fat, so I bought more bear fat. Uh, let's see if there's anything that we can make. Draconid oil. What are we missing? Ergo seeds. Hmm. She might sell those. Let's pen it because God knows we know how to do that. Ooh, superior hangman. Hanged man. 50% attack power versus human sh shit. Yeah. I think this is first superior that we've been able to make. I think. Alright. Let's go ahead and talk to her again. Let's see if she has those. I know I've Greetings. seen them before. Greetings. Greetings. Mind if I have. We took a turn into the deep south, apparently. Uh, she does not. Damn it. Okay. Well, we need to be on the lookout for Aragodal seeds. See ya. Fare thee well. Fare thee well yourself. All right. So, the quest we are going to do today. Uh, it's. I'm getting distracted by those exclamation marks and those bulletin boards. They're calling my name. Please do us. Do us now. The only time I've ever hurt anything to do me, by the way. At least that sultrily. Uh, but anyway, we're going to look for the sun first. I think it's the sun. God damn it, it's up here, isn't it? Because one of these... God damn it. Uh, one of these... Is, uh, like, high up. The... Like the signpost, and the other one is down low, too slow. <sighs> Sorry, cat's sitting in front of the keyboard again, because if she's not the center of attention, then the world's gonna end. If it's been a few, you know, minutes since she's been petted, then God knows everything's gonna end. Yeah, I maybe should have just poured the other one. We'll get that figured out eventually. Let's see if Roach can get caught up here. Hurry up, Roach. There we go faster. I also switched out his... where is it? His blinders. We got Zara Kevian blinders somewhere. So 60 versus 40 what it was. Come on. So that's nice. Yeah, this game desperately needs a parachute. Why am I going further? Wait, god, god damn it. Hold on. I think it was leading me the wrong way. It sure was. That's I don't I that's one thing I don't like. Like for example, I have that one marked. Like this quest has two parts. Like it has the optional part, which is just a scale or scale. Sail straight there. I presume. Actually, I guess neither one of them are optional. I don't know. Anyway, I set one to be the target, but the roadmap still tries to send me over to the thing. I found another bug too. I was playing uh, I was playing Gwent, which I know it's hard to believe. And those unit cards that can either go in a melee row or the range row, I, uh, I had, typically what happens with those, like if you do, I'm going to just port to the other damn signpost. Uh, typically what, the way those work is like, let's say I put one of those in the, the range row. And then the next round I use a medic to pull them back. Because it doesn't put them in your hand, it typically will place it wherever you put it. So if you put it in the range row previously, it puts it in the range row. If you put it in the melee, it puts it in the melee. But now it was always putting it in the melee, and that completely boned me because it like that was part of my strategy was to put him in the ranged row. Uh, so I don't know what was up with that. But anywho, uh, this is the guy I played actually, uh, the innkeeper in here. So we need to ask around. I do know the innkeeper said something because I actually asked him once on accident and had to reload. Ah, you had guys have the same music we had to do at the mainland. 
I thought she had like a mustache for a second there. I'm just, just, hi, I haven't took a shower the whole time before. Just gotcha. Heard Yalmar came here to gather men for his expedition. Aye, he did. Such spirit. Stormed in, swept the bowls off the table, jumped atop of it and cried, I'm sailing off to seek glory. Who's with me? Who wants to cut off that bloody giant's head? Guess that was enough to recruit a longboat full of men. Ah, they carried him out in their shoulders, yelling all the while, we'll win back the forge, string that giant up by his gizzards. Should have seen it, Witcher. Brought tears to my eyes. Yalmar seems popular around here. He is crack, son. Clever lad. Put together a fine crew. Hardy drinkers and warriors both. By the times I've had to piece together tables and benches after hosting them. The Unvik lads he took on. No spring minnows either. In fact, was a clan Tordorach man gave Yalmar the idea for the expedition. The shipwright, uh, what's his name? Figgy? That's him. Hope to earn a new by name, the Fearless. Well, now they'd call him the Loom. They wanted to take back a forge? What's that about? Never heard the Unvickers forge the best armor in these isles. Their swordsmiths are nothing to sneeze at either. Because we made our blades like the dwarves forge the hills. Soft layered core fitted with a hard steel coating. How do you know? That's a clan Tordorach secret. Got some friends who are dwarves. Perhaps you do. But the ore from the mines of Undvik, why not even... Well, no one's got it. That's that. Yalmar must have had a plan. Tell me about it. Plans? Ha! <laughs> they didn't even know where to look for this giant. As I recall, Viggy wanted to cross a frozen lake and scale the mountains. They say the giant came from there? Awoken by the frost that gripped the land around the tower? To the harsh winter. Suited that man-eater perfectly. It can only get worse. Even the gods... Well... Complete a thought, mm -hmm. son. If you're gonna talk, Another one be ready to finish. Is nigh. You'll see. All of yous. All right, Ragnarok is nigh. Okay, whatever, so, guys. Glad to be of service. Prepare for the end times. If you need to know more about Undvik or the giant, ask Axel. <laughs> or that one over there. That that <laughs> uh, that plate over there knows a lot. Can I talk to these survivors that were running the rounds before? Well, they talked about the forge that that dwarf asked us to get forever ago. At least I'm pretty sure that's it. We're gonna kind of have to guess if we can find this person. Since their models weren't loaded or they were in the bathroom or something. I'm looking for men from Undvik. Yavor's from the Isle, and I once cut those waters with Mary Arrest. Could trace you the shoreline in my sleep. Uh, a lovely excursion, if not for the bloody sirens. I'm the one to ask. Me or excellent Tadarok. He's over there. What can a bloke from Art Skellig know about Unvik? Heard you trilling a different tune when Yalmar was gathering his crew. Your love for the Ancrete fade that quick. Ah, that doesn't mind dying, dire. <laughs> Alright, sorry the sound is so low. I think it's because there's an actual band in the end. The music's a little higher than normal. I might go uh, lower it just a little bit after this. Need to get to Unvik. Ugh, another thrill seeker. Well then, listen close, lest you end in a watery grave. Sail out of port and head southwest. Watch for rocks protruding like pricks out of the water. You'll have to do some tricky tacking to get past them. Some of them shorter, just below the surface, so careful not to scrape right over them. Big breach your hull, you're done for. Cause just a few minutes in that icy water makes a corpse. One time I remember... Stick to the point. Uh, oh, fine. Watch for the currents, because they can drag you off course, dash against the rocks even. With a bit of luck, you'll land on the same beach where Jalmar landed. Yalvar's from there, or so he claims. And you seem to know these waters. Why didn't you sail with Yalmar? Because that kind of expedition needs a true leader. And a whelp looking to collect bumps on his skull can only be its doom. Once I 
You'd rather sit in your harsh nose in the air, you Zeracadian princess. Brave lad, come to the long. You sail with him. I'd have sailed with Yalmar if only those seahorse hadn't banjacked my knee. Would have sailed instead of sharing a table with a grumpy barnacle like you. You'd sail with anyone who'd let you aboard. Crack's daughter included. <laughs> you mentioned sirens. Many on Undvik? So, so many. More on the other as. Bollocks. Once they attacked Lars and me when we were fishing. Before we could drive him off, they pulled Lars in the water and scratched me up so bad that... Oi! Drive away the sirens? How's that work? Ha! Huh. Plain to see you're no islander. With a horn wall's horn. One toot, and they plough and scurry off so quick the weeds rock your boat. Nice talking to you. By the time I was on my way. So long. Fair winds to you. The wind's always at my back, baby. Alright, let's change that music real quick. It actually might be under uh, ambient. Lower it down here a bit. I'll probably put it back later. Yeah, it seems about the same. But yeah, I think this is probably all the people we can really talk to. Yeah! Fjord! <laughs> ah, ah. Let's talk to this guy trying to play the flute. Hey, you guys sound like that band. It must be a cover band of the one that tours around Bellin. Alright, oh god, this one's really far away. Alright, let's find out where the hell it wants us to go. Oh god! Holy ball sacks. Uh, wow. That's pretty far. So let's go up. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so I have an idea. Because I am a genius. First, we're gonna try to remember. Okay, the the sign is over here. I really want to be to push those guys in the water. You just don't know. Um, I want to talk to this herbalist real quick, actually. Would you like to buy something from this stash? Okay, this sounds a little suspicious, but all right. Maybe. Let me see what you got. Alright, does he have the seeds? He does not because he sucks. He does have bear fed though. Which is nice, but eh, damn it. So long. Uh, by the way, I don't remember if I mentioned this in another video or not. Before I had thought that if you pulled the, like, get the runes out of a weapon, it would destroy the weapon. That is actually not the case. You get to keep the weapon. I am going the wrong way, aren't I? Damn it. Almost! I was almost there. But basically what we're going to do here is I'm going to travel to that other uh, road sign and I will ride to the coast because one, it'll be faster. Two, we'll probably find some road signs no respect for our and that will open up further fast travel options for us. See, I'm a genius. Ranvag. This is where that herbalist is, the lady with the, um, with the freckles. Gone ballistic. Come on. All over her face. It's cute. But I mean, goddamn, she really does have a lot of them. Alright. We need to head southwest, correct? Alright. I mean, there's obviously a town there, so yeah, we're gonna probably run into sync things on the way. I think this is a somewhat long quest, so don't be surprised if this one gets cut up a little bit weird. I'll probably try to find like a cutoff point. Around 40-ish minutes, 30 minutes. All right, this, this has got to be something. At least want to mark it on the map. Or, oh, hello, dead person with claw marks all over your back. I'm sure, that's not anything. Fiend. Oh shit! How you doing? God damn, that didn't do shit. What level is this thing? Do I want to know? Get off! God damn. Apparently, the game doesn't want me to know either. Yeah, nope. Yeah, he's got a bajillion fucking hit points.
Man, I don't think we're gonna bother. Nah, it's not worth it. It's gonna, like I say, it's gonna take forever. Run, Geralt. Geralt, run, you dumb shit. Ugh. I hate when he gets into combat, like, he just ref like, that's one of the problems with the combat in this game, is that it treats combat as some, like, a different mode. So he'll, like, he's bad about not running properly. He'll just stop. And it's a pain in the ass to get him to start running again. Even if you on, ignore Rose. stamina. Uh, let's go ahead and... Come on. Now run. Because it's not even showing his level, which is weird. But whatever it is, it's not going to be worth it. Um, we need to head south the other west. There we go. Hey, a bunch of wild asses. <laughs> wild asses. There's also some lights over here. I want to see what this is. Thank you. Better it is that thing you said. Damn it! Can we get some more damn road signs, please? Travel points. But yeah, like the combat is so bad about locking you in. Oh, for God's sakes! I hate horses. Go! Jesus Christ! He's like, eh, eh. There's got to be one over here. There's one. All right, hopefully this is it. Yeah, this is the town I started in. God damn it. All right, let's get out of here. But, um, so after like five minutes, we've made zero progress. No, god damn it, no, I've got to focus. This is already going to be a while. But, uh, yeah, like, it puts you in that separate mode. What the fuck? How am I making circles constantly? Here. But, uh, yeah, like, it puts you in a different mode. It like lock try, keeps trying to lock in, which to some extent is okay, sort of. Don't you? Don't enter Seriously, still. Anyway? Got to be a sign. Come on now. Let's go. Oh God damn it. <sighs> we'll do this later, but we'll we'll go through We've this. Offended him, Sven. The woodland spirit seeks revenge. This here is him saying we've strayed from the old paths. Offended him. The monster's killed five already. He doesn't give a rat's arse about paths or tracks or me or you. He's a plowing beast from the plowing forest. Split his ribcage. A strong one, this spirit of yours. That's so. And who might you be? Geralt. I'm a witcher. A killer for hire. What do you seek here? Just passing through, looking for work. This village is home to decent folk only. You won't find any work here. Sure about that? Beast that did this, it's aggressive and incredibly strong. I can help you for a price. I like this man. Ply your trade, Witcher. I believe we will agree terms. Who or what is this woodland spirit? Tell you what, it's not any of your concern. It's a common beast. Murders any man who ventures into its territory. Exhaustive as descriptions go. What does this spirit look like? Anyone seen it for themselves? No man alive has. Great. Really helpful, all of you. Geralt, come on now. Birds pecked apart his entrails. And here, tooth marks. A large dog. A wolf, maybe. This the way it always kills? Only cowards. True warriors. Men with the hearts of predators. The spirit grants them an honorable death. You said the creature wants revenge. Why? For what? Our forefathers hunted with spear and knife. This pleased the woodland spirit. He let us live in peace. We never knew hunger. He killed back then, too. He's always killed. How many lads died trying to become hunters? Now, since our hunters died in the war, the beasts turned even more bloodthirsty. We are uncreate. What others buy with gold, we buy with our lifeblood. We are slaves to fear spread by blind fools like you. These woods are ours. High time we put an end to this beast. I've heard enough. 
You've got a monster problem, that's clear. Just not sure you want it solved. Oh, we do. Come see me. We'll figure us a fair price for the beast's head. Our little talk while I looked over the corpse? Not nearly enough. Need to look around, figure out what I'm up against. Be not rash, killer. It's not too late to bring back the old ways. Old ways or dumb ways. I decide what to do. But start collecting coin, just in case. Alright. So obviously we'll come back to that later. But yeah, what I was saying about the combat was, like, the combat itself is not bad if it's in the, the thing. Stop eating their apples, Roach. Come on. That's rude. But, like, the fact that it kind of locks you in. Ooh, I like that. Nice. Well, that's good, because I had to run all the way back to, uh, to Velen to get a damn blacksmith. Anyway, it locks you in, blah, blah, you got it. I keep stopping like that. God, fucking damn it. That's what kills you about the horse, too. Like, sometimes it just seems like he gets stopped by nothing. Obviously, there wasn't nothing there, but something made him stop, but I couldn't even see what it was. This is a hell of a run. At least this place looks nice. Oh, speaking of nice, there's a... Slow now. Whoa. What the hell? We were just hanging out. Alright, whatever. Well, they didn't give me a sign, and they didn't attack, so... Oh, God. Seriously. I fucking hate horses so much. But you play... Slower. No, no, get off. Move up here, two inches. Call him. Have him come... Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh, good Lord Almighty. Shut up, kid. Not in the mood for your shit. Whatever stupid kid things you're saying, stop doing them. Soon. Okay, good. We got another map marker. And that's mostly what I want is map markers, so that we don't have to make these long runs anymore. Keep. Oh, damn. Damn. Didn't take a long dive, there, didn't you? Get out of here. Sirens. Did I ever get an entry for them? Like a bestiary? Oh, hey. They hurt you badly. I'm fine. I really showed them, didn't I? You saved my life. Thanks. Seen sirens around here before? Aye, of course. They fly in from Unvik, the isle cursed by the gods. Damn she beasties. Enough chatter. My brother awaits. Thanks for the help, stranger. Your gods grant ye health. My gods are on my back. But seriously, where's the body? I want the bodies. The bodies hit the floor, and now I want them. I think they're over here. Maybe? Butts! Those damn sheep ate the sirens. This is bullshit. Alright, I forgot to turn the music back up a little bit. We gotta have the music. We gotta have that very familiar tune blasted in your ears the whole time. Every time we get into combat. Alright. Mount up. God, there's gonna be so many question marks that we're gonna find. I'm still not saying I'm gonna get all of them. But. Jesus H. You think there's enough? Nope. Keep, keep running, jackass. I'm not gonna... Waste my time killing all of them. Wait, is this even the right way? Oh, uh, we were just heading for the dock. So, oh, there's a boat. Another fucker. Come on. Why can't you stupid horses be as agile as people? Hey, I know there's a town over there, but I can't be arsed. Good luck, Roach. Good luck with those, uh... Good luck with those sirens, buddy. I remember this every time you get stuck on an invisible wall, you asshole. Probably find some question marks while we're out here. Alright. We are sailing away. Yeah, I do know there was like a say a little island over there, or a little city, but hopefully we can sneak through here. I feel like this lighthouse not doing a hell of a lot of good. There's <laughs> a shitload of boats crashed in here. Oh, we can we can skim through here, right? 
Probably. Or we can destroy our boat. Let's find out which one of those two happens. We'll, we'll take our finger off the ship. Yep. Alright, is there any boats over there? God damn. Uh, I don't think this is going to work. Yeah, let's go get this other boat that's on the other side of the map. Nope. God damn it. Did you get out of the water? Controls today, I swear to God. Alright, let's go get this boat on this side of the goddamn... Clear out those damn rocks, somebody. Damn, find something to do with your lives. What the hell? I don't know what that was, but I got it. And seriously, hire somebody to go clear out those rocks, for God's sakes. Probably make this place a lot more safe, so they can actually get in between. Ugh, Lord almighty. This game really does like to make it difficult to get from one place to another sometimes. Oop. There we go. I just knew he was gonna, like, rant, like smash his legs against the rocks. Below. Feels like we've made very little progress. Get your ass out of the water. Ooh, lighthouse? Okay. Oh, we got a marker for the lighthouse. Sweet. Take the helm. Alright. So, theoretically, if we don't hit that, should be smooth sailing, literally. I'm sure there'll be about five gajillion drowners out here, but. Yeah, it's not too too bad. Actually, I think it is. It feels like it is definitely slower than running with Roach. Jesus H. All right, we're gonna stop there. Whoa! <laughs> awesome. I definitely would not want to hit my boat into that though, because that would suck. I got the uh, I saw on over there. What are you sirens even doing? Just kind of hanging out in the middle of the ocean. It's fine. I wonder if some, like, some developer talking earlier about how they handcraft every part. I wonder if some poor sucker developer got tasked with, uh, like, figuring out, like, designing the bottom of the ocean below us. Probably not. God, I hope so. Or I hope not. Smuggler's cash. We're not gonna bother. I feel like we're already like dragging them behind here. Actually, you know what? There's no enemies. F it. Might as well. It's coming back out here. Probably a pain in the ass. Only one chest anyway. Actually, has something good in it. Blades, bear, hides, pelt. Oh, there's. I was gonna say it's still white. There's got to be more. There needs to be a potion that makes you swim faster. That, okay, now it's great. That, or we need to talk to Philip Einhart. Eilhart. Where's my boat? Oh, God. We need to talk to Philip Einhart and have her teach us how to turn into a sea lion or some shit. Alright, take the helm, Geralt. Take the helm of my heart. And let's move forward. Getting pretty close here. Maybe we'll help kill us a frost giant. That's pretty fun. Another crash boat? Good lord. I thought you people were supposed to be good at sailing. These islands are made up of like 10% rocks, 90% crash boats. Insurance has got to be a real bitch to get out here. Holy hell. Lord of Unvik. Explore the ruins of Ulskar and search for signs of Haljmar's presence. Fantastic! <laughs> He's like, ah, you know you thought you were close, you little bitch. Nope. Oop. Let's not let's not wreck our one boat. Let's not do our showboaty slamming the boat into the shore thing until we can secure another one. I see Gethy in the boat here. Alright, oh, 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 can we Can we uh, drift it in? Look at oh. Yep. Perfect. 
perfect. It was perfect. It had that hole on the side when I brought it here. If you guys might want to rewind the video. That hole was there when I picked up the boat. Anybody who says otherwise will be banned. Just FYI. Alright. Looks like a kicking village over here. Plenty of stuff to st I mean, uh, reappropriate. I won't go through every house. I will... I will contain myself. By the way, I was just looking through my inventory looking for stuff to sell. I've got like 200 and something Dwarven Spirits. It's crazy. If only... Oh god, do I really want to summon Roach? No you don't. I know I don't. Hello. Buckthorn. Buckthorn Cherry. Actually, I couldn't even name one of their songs by... B. My life depended on it. I know that name though. Not Buckthorn Cherry, but Buck Cherry, right? That's right. I guess. I don't know. Not really that in the music. All right, it's all the good music died when I left my mid twenties. Does every human to ever exist? Damn. <laughs> the uh, lumberjack finals ended tragically today. What are those lumberjack competitions where, like, see who's the best lumberjack? You know what I'm talking. Well, Americans, you probably know what I'm talking about. Don't. Well, Americans and Canadians, they probably do that shit too. Actually, it's probably Canadians who come up with it. Oh, hey. Glen on great. Yes. Glen on great. Oh, I thought he was looking at the shield. Ooh, master armorer's kit. We actually haven't had to use an armorer's kit lately. I've been better. At remembering to actually repair and shit, which is nice for everyone involved. This is where it's going to be start to be a pain in the ass to move around. I can already tell. Oh, ah, there you go. Oh, shit. All right. Does it look important at all? Oh shit! Double shit! That ass. Oh man, I want you to slide and shoot him. Like that'd have been sweet as hell. All right. Yeah, this. I long to be home. Sit down. Oh. Oh, whoa, whoa. I got an insta kill on that. Man, these sirens have a beautiful singing voice. Boosh! Oh! Get wrecked. And they just keep singing while they're dead. This is the first time I've killed. I've killed like. I feel like I've killed like 10 sirens, and this is the first time I've actually been able to loot them. Oh! Diagram the Arbitrator. Wait, Arbitrator? Is that right? Shouldn't it be like Arbit. Arbitrator? Arbit. Never mind. Someone dragged a litter through here. <laughs> Smells like ammonia. Giant tracks. Okay, see? It's all right. Seems it like they did. They fixed that with the patch. Where I was talking about before, it's still it's still weird how some things turn yellow and others don't. I feel like that's a bug, but the little hourglass goes away. So it's showing like okay, you don't need to investigate this anymore. I'm pretty I sure it did not do that before. I long all right, let's go visit the singing boat. To the What's up, dog? I know that song. What are you doing here? Look, man. Another one. And so many times I've told him. What's that you say, Wilfred? <laughs> right you are. they never learn. At least this one heard a song before he died. Who were these men? My crew. They swore never to leave me. Kept their word. Tall one's Wilmar, Wilfred's to his right, and the lad with the stutter's Wilhelm. 
Why do you and your crew stay? We cannot leave. If we ventured it again, the giant would kill us all, like he did the others. Why'd the giant spare you? Me and my crew and the sirens. We're helping him build a longship. I sew the sails and run away at times, and then the sirens fly out and bring me back. Why does he need a ship? Where does he want to go? Promise not to tell no one. I trust my men to take the secret to their graves. But you, Trip promise, trip. won't tell anyone. Fine then. The giant's going to sail her out to defeat the gods come Ragnarok. The final battle for the world's end. She'll soon be ready. Not much game here, but I saw the giant give you food. Where's he <laughs> getting? Did you? Don't know. Don't ask. Food suits me. Suits my crew. Over there, on the ground. Hands got bite marks on it. What? Where? Well, Mark, damn it. You're supposed to clean up. Couldn't keep a secret if your life depended on it. We had a choice. Had or starved to death. And I didn't force anyone. You know, whole crew voted in favor. I'm looking for Hjalmar on crate. Word is he came to this isle with a crew, aimed to defeat the giant. Oh, oh, I saw him, as did Wilmar. Sure it was him? Wilmar's got eyes like a hawk. They stood where you stand now. Poor sheep they were in, neath the red, fallen Viggy. And just between you and me, that boy's not quite right in the head. Oh, the young on Crete was here too. Remember when this was? When what was? When Hjalmar on Crete was here with his men. Oh, that? No, I don't remember. You might ask Wilhelm, though. They say where they were headed. Did they, Wilmer? Oh, hey. Aim to make camp in the old guard tower. <laughs> Easy enough to find. Stands in the middle of a valley, guarding absolutely nothing. Try to come back for you once I've found Hjalmar. <laughs> Sound awfully sure you'll find him? Maybe you can kill the giant while you're at it, all on your own. They're the same to a man, aren't they, Wilhelm? All think themselves immortal. Gotta go. So long. Hey, if you really aim to return, mind bring me some solid twine. You're like to find it in the village. And nails. We're short on nails. Can you remember that? Nails and twine. I'll remember. I won't probably remember. This actually talks to him again. We might have it already. Look there, crew! Whitehair's returned! What brings you to us? The nails, probably not so much. Okay. I should go. Probably like a special item I have to buy. Fair you. All right, what do you got in these sparrows here? Maybe I could find some twine and nails. Got a lot of ashes. Apparently, got a lot of ash to uh, transport to the new world. Big trade in ash. Rich people love to snort it. No reason. Doesn't make them feel good. In fact, it kills a lot of them. But, you know, rich people, they just do what other rich people do. Dow! Bro, oh, stop being such a wussy. <laughs> oh, damn. Ooh, hello. He's more like it. Ah, yeah. Skellige Gam Gambison? Gambison? I should really just learn what all these things are. We got a lot of ash for Alchemy, I guess. Find Jalmer's camp. Why are they in two separate areas? I guess this is the tower? Yeah. So let's mark that one. There's no confusion. Well, this giant's got him building a boat. Like I said, that part I kind of did see previously. And by kind of see, see, I mean I completely saw. Show me what you got. Haha. <laughs> I wonder if I could have insta killed him if I'd have got a little closer. Someone dragged a litter oh, through right. here. Oh, there actually was a magnifying glass. Well, shit, maybe it doesn't work like it's supposed to. All right, let's follow these. Well, 
We're not necessarily looking for the giant right now. Do we want the... I'm gonna guess... Yeah. Someone dragged a litter yeah. through here. Alright, so we're gonna go this way. Which works, because this is where our little waypoint is. Because I presume that's how they were dragging their supplies. The shit. Sirens in the sky the with diamonds. They were attacked. Oh damn! Wonder if they made it. Fought barefoot. Sirens caught them by surprise. Girl, you and I have different definitions of what barefoot is. That dog had a wolf's liver. Scavengers got to this one. Taken by surprise, but they fought off the attack. I need more clues. Several men. Search the perimeter north. <laughs> I'm talking over myself. Too many thoughts just slamming my brain. Two people came through here separately. These tracks are older. Somebody left the camp before the attack. They got destroyed. Follow these tracks. Let's see what we can find. Oh, something's making noise up here. That tree, apparently. Nope. Not the tree. <laughs> Being careful, I don't want anything to sneak up on us. Oh. Started off the side. Oh, hello. Whoa, oh, hello. Landed smack in a necker's <laughs> layer and cut the beast down. Hardy folk, these skeligers. You just like to say Skelliger. To be fair, so do I. Um, okay. Guess you didn't want to look that badly. Did you say two sets of tracks? I guess there was just the one. Yeah, it looks like just one, sort of. Looks like he was if it was one, he's like hopping. One arrow in each. Good eye. One arrow in each. Good eye. Oh, hello. He ducked off the trail here. <laughs> That's weird. So it's like that that my, that eyeglass thing doesn't a hundred percent. Like sometimes it works. Someone used this as cover. From the other side. Yeah, see, he's like kneeling down to check the prints, but then he doesn't say anything. Got hit here first, but kept going. Look at oh, hello. Kept going, though he could barely walk. Kept going, though he could barely walk. You gotta barely walk before you can barely run, girl. Um. There he goes. Like the I had was holding right click, but it wasn't uh, doing anything. Lost a lot of blood. Couldn't have gone much further. Lost a lot of blood. All right. Couldn't have gone much further. Looking where he might have went. Lost a lot of blood. Couldn't have gone much further. <laughs> As you say for like the next hour and a half. All right. I don't think we need to keep examining it. Oh, I think we found them. Took a second arrow here. Got him good this time. Now where'd that archer go? Oh, hello. Quest items. You have a new quest item. Prepare it for use by placing it in the appropriate slot in the inventory panel, then selecting it from the quick access menu. Did it automatically equip it? No, it did not this time. I don't think we need it just yet. We need it for the getting rid of the stupid harpies. Rolls. Dragged him into the cave. Wonder if he's still alive. Wait, where's the entrance? Okay, there we go. I didn't drag him in the cave. You had to pull him up there. Archer was wounded too. Wait, so I thought there was just the two. 
going over here first. It could be goodies. <laughs> More boats, because... Why not? Hmm. Nope, alright. Well, what ifs? Ah! For no reason. Alright, let's go find out what happened to this person to get dragged into the cave. Come on! You piece of filth. Say it. Alright. Actually, first. Oh shit, I already have it selected. Son of a bitch! Gonna drink my tawny owl. Come on, you little prick. You're just gonna be a little dick, aren't you? What? Are you seriously that hit me? Bullshit on that. <sighs> Alright, so Axie pretty much. Oh, now he comes down. Look at that flame damage, son. <laughs> Going a little slow there, big guy. Later, hater. Going rocks. God, Yurden is so good. Of course, they're like, I think I need a troll heart or something. Of that troll did not want to talk, apparently. Uh, which way? Where are we going? This way, I think. No, not there we go. Like, man, he didn't bleed for a while. He ran out. Looks like he found some more. Found mm, some more blood bleeding. Something cooking over there. That's probably a good thing. Oh, holy shit. A lot of exits to this place, it seems. God damn. How fucking far do they drag his ass? Here we go. Don't fall into it, it's a trap. Cooking something? Take him with me. If I lose, I'll jump in the pot too. Good! Good! Why <laughs> 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 cry? No bubble! First riddle. Not eat, not drink. Big E B. Step big he. Big he bash. A clock. A troll, of course. Uh, good troll. Now you ask. I'm light as a feather, but even a troll can't hold me for long. I 
one fair and square. Your stupid riddle, feather, troll not hold, not this. <laughs> what? Your English needs a lot of work. Uh, can you walk? Uh, I, uh, I'll manage. Uh, let's get out of here. Thanks for this loose shirt. That'll protect against the blistering winter winds. You all right? Never go in a sauna again, long as I live. Other than that, I think I'm fine. His hands are red. Nice touch. You saved my life. How can I thank you? I'm looking for Hjalmar. Hjalmar? Curious where he is myself. Him and the whole crew. Something must have happened. Otherwise, he'd have come looking for me after I went missing that night. I know he would have. Speaking of... Wait now. Why are you looking for Yalmar? The expedition. Tell me about it. Started like the best ballads. With a hearty storm. Sail whipped about like a rag. Finally caught sight of shore. But then sirens attacked. As if they'd just been biding their time. But we'd have come through somehow, I know it. If not for the bloody helmsman. Helmsman made a mistake? I'd say his ma made the mistake. Birthed them arseways or something. Uh, I don't Didn't know if that, that one. works. Heard tales and was so afraid of sirens he stuffed wax in his ears. Failed to hear our warning calls. Steered us right into the rocks. Lost a few men. Had to drag the wounded on litters. And the sirens pestered us the whole while. Yalmar kept blowing his horn. But we'd come too close to the hillside and he brought an avalanche down on us. Not your lucky day, it seems. What happened next? We found that daft bugger in the ship. Then pitched camp near the guard tower. Things seemed to come. <sighs> Sorry, I can't decide to get in the damn way. Croc sent me here to find Yalmar. New king will soon be chosen on Ard Skellig. Everybody's waiting for the young on Crate's return. So it started already. Yalmar, ruler of all Skellige. Doubt he's cut out for it. Yalmar's irresponsible, stubborn, and heeds no counsel. But he's a born leader. Heeds no counsel and Being born leader don't we go lads. together. With him, man, Ceres. Ceres has put forth her claim to the throne as well. Ceres? But she's... Well, she's... Like father, like daughter. What about Crack? He support her? He let her set off on some daft quest. Wasn't thrilled, especially since Sarah set out without telling him. Nor did she tell me. Where'd she go? Who'd she take with her? Speaker Og. And no one. She went alone? Damn the dogs! If Yalmard only... Has she come back, do you know? Hadn't returned when I left Ard Skellig. Any idea where Yalmar thought he might find the giant? We'd learned where it has its lair, in the caves above the village. Yalmar decided the best way there would be to cross the lake. Viggy the loon insisted he knew a better way, through the mines. But none of us fancied strolling into a monster pit. How'd you get separated from the others? <clears throat> Had the watch for the night. Saw Egnar of Faro steal Yalmar's hornwall horn. One he uses to drive away sirens. Bugger snuck out of camp. I followed him. No idea what got into that ginger head of his. Told Yalmar not to take him with us a thousand times at least. And? You catch up to him? Aye. In these caves. Bastard screeched so loud he drew the trolls. Thought the buggers would eat me right then. Dropped me in a marinade instead. Decided I was ready to cook today. Would have been the end of me if not for you. Think I know enough. So long. Wait. I'll go with you. Luckily the trolls didn't use my bow for kindling. Good to have him with us. He's got a good eye. Good. Let's oh. go. Also, my armor, I happen to find that. Hey, 